I'll tell you what I do know about tractors. What I do know about tractors is it's um, when it comes to acoustics, right off the bat, you're starting with an equation that gives you maximum power transfer. Okay? Now, I also want to say, and I've told a lot of my friends this, it's not like I have a patent on tractrix. I don't. If I find another equation tomorrow that's better than tractrix, I'm there. Because I'm not about tractrix, I'm about the best horn equation I can use to make the best sounding horns that we can. Right now it's tractrix. So then what I wanted to do is I wanted to find out if we could modify the horn equation in order to give us different coverage patterns. Um, and so I proceeded down that path and found out, yes, the tractrix equation is, is it's not one of the easiest to work with, but it can be modified in order to give us different coverage patterns. That in itself is another big step forward because a lot of the constant coverage horns that were out there were based on three distinct equations and were not very smooth and you could hear how they sounded. Um, and with a Tractrix horn, because it con it's a continuous expansion, you don't really hear that. I remember when we first did our first shoot shootouts with uh, Regal, uh, we literally had five competitors behind the screen and us. And they, you know, they asked me, what are we gonna hear? And I said, no man, just listen. You tell me which one you like. And almost to, to a man, they all could tell which one was the most natural sounding and it was the clutch. That's why I love demos. Like I said, I can't give you a curve that says speaker sucks, speaker sounds good. And, uh, but ultimately it comes down to a demo. It's hard, to, it's hard to pinpoint and proof in the pudding is listen to it. I, I have never heard a clip or speaker until I came to interview. And I was like, damn, that sound good and never knew what a horn was. 45 minutes I came out of talking with Paul and convinced that's the only way to do a speaker. And, uh, and when I heard them, I was totally blown away by them. And, he, and I said, you know, how, how do you make them sound like that? And he said, this is 20% no one pays attention to. And I went, huh? <laughs> Back then, I'm like, what? Okay. <laughs>